Okay guys, so this is the front door. Do not mind the boxes, they're always here. Trash day is tomorrow. Amazon, I love you. All right, so if you walk over here and you're standing at the door, this is the view that you see. And this is just a random closet. It has some Christmas stuff in here and a few jackets or whatever, but nothing too serious. Um, it's supposed to be a coat closet, but I have coats in the other coat closet. So um, this, like I said, this is what you see when you come this way. Don't mind this rug. It's not supposed to be here, but it's here. This is the garage. And my baby. Hey girl. Okay, so on this wall you have two different doors and I have a mirror right there. But in the first door, this is my powder room. It just has a toilet, that's all, and a sink and a mirror. What's up? Deep condition if you care. So yeah, that's this bathroom. Just have some hand soap in there. And this is the kitchen, but before we get to that, this is another closet. This is just like the coat closet, but I just have a lot of like arts and crafts and th different things in here that I just store, basically store stuff. All right, and then you see the kitchen and let me just give you guys a good look at what my kitchen looks like compared to walking through the door. So this is what it looks like. It has an island, pretty much a basic kitchen i'm actually about to fry some chicken so that's why that pops there i love the open floor plan i love that i can see my guests because this is my living room and this is like my dining table i actually got this table from my job but i think it's from ikea it's very expensive though but my job someone was selling it for 75 dollars for the whole set so i got that <laughs> and um that's my pantry by the way if you guys want to see like an individual tour on different rooms in my house then you can definitely do that just let me know in the comment section below if you want to see like a kitchen tour living room tour where i actually go through specific things that are in each room so this is the living room and this is what it looks like the couch is from z gallery the throw pillows are from burlington i think this table here is from Jocelyn, Maine. I love this table. And I just got the decorations from Burlington as well that's on top. And um, the rug is from, y'all, the rug is from RugUSA.com. I think I'll link them below. This rug was $200. And do you see how huge and beautiful this rug is? Like, I, they have 50% off all the time. And I'm in love. These lamps that are on the side are from... I think they're from Burlington as well. And these um, little tables are from at home, which are really beautiful. I love them, they're simple. I don't need any drawers, I don't need any storage in here. So I was like, let me just get some simple little side tables and that's exactly what I did. And I love these lamps because they're actually not heavy. They're like super duper light. Um, so I can kind of move it, clean that and go about my day. Um, and I also got this chandelier from it's actually from china and i think it's really affordable i will link it below for you guys to check it out but i am obsessed with it the only thing about this chandelier that i did not like is that i had to put all these pieces together but i got someone in atlanta to do it and they did it for like under 100 bucks and i was happy so absolutely love and i have hardwood floors which i love and then i have a fireplace here with my TV and I have lights around it. The lights are kind of falling, but I can change the color and at night it looks so good. And then I have a mirror so that when I'm sitting on my beautiful couch, I can see how beautiful it is. I'm just kidding. Now this, this mirror actually was um, from at home and it was like 40 bucks, 40, 50 bucks. Anyway, obsessed. So that is basically the full view of downstairs. Um, I am going to be adding on out here in the backyard, like a lot of stuff. So once I get that done, I'll give you guys a tour, but right now it looks a hot mess. So um, now we can go upstairs. These are what the stairs look like. Very high ceilings, I love it, I love it. <gasps> Do, do, do. And I've been here for two years, guys, just in case you're wondering. Actually, two and a half years, so 
the fact that I'm just getting to see you guys, it's been a long time. So when you come up here, this is not finished, but I just wanted to go ahead and show you guys. This isn't finished, I just kind of threw some stuff right there. And then I have a few paintings I'm gonna kind of restructure and add them to the house somewhere. I don't know where though. So right here is the guest room. And I kind of changed this room to be more of a lounging area. But it's still the guest room because this is a sofa bed. So they can pull the bed out and it's a complete bed and they love it. But if I just want to chill in here and just kind of, I do dry my hair in here. I'll kind of like lay on the couch right here and then I'll dry my hair. But this is what it looks like. Let me give you an overview. I just started talking. So this rug was downstairs. This rug was actually $200 as well. But as you can see, it's not as big as the other one so that's why i was saying the other one was a great deal because this one right here was the same price if not more and even though it's super soft and i love it it was just very expensive so yep and this bed is from rooms to go i forgot what bed it is but if i can figure it out i'll let you guys know and i'll link it below i just got this tv mounted i don't like cords i don't know what i'm gonna do with this situation yet but I'll let you guys know in kind of like a vlog maybe because I am going to start by vlogging. So yeah, I'll let you know what I do with that. What do you guys think I should do? Like, I don't know. I don't have a plug back there. I need to probably get a plug back there so that the cords and stuff aren't running, you know, down here. That's so tacky. And then I just have some random stuff over here like filming equipment and just some extra little arts and crafts stuff. And then I have a dresser where I just keep some stuff and i keep all my like traveling stuff suitcases packing situations and then extra blankets and stuff up there and pillows and stuff so that's pretty much this room um i don't know where i get this from this old <laughs> so old you can get that kind of stuff from like tj tj maxx or something so yeah that's the guest room and then this is the guest bathroom it's yellow and gray just kind of like the kind of like the room so it's nothing special, but it is the guest bathroom. If you guys want to just check that out. Okay. And this, you guys, is the beauty room. You guys are very familiar with this because that's where I film. And you guys see it in my Instagram stories. So when you walk in this, when you walk in, this is the view that you get of the room. And if I come in to do a pen, you guys have seen that. I've already posted a video on my, my, my product stash. So make sure you check that out. So guys, just to let you know, I can give you guys a full tour on this room. These are curtains that I purchased from, um, I don't know, I think Amazon. But my black and white wall is still back here, guys. I know a lot of you are like, Dang, what did you do? But the black and white wall is still back there. I just hung up curtains. Like the most simple thing you can ever do is to just hang up some curtains and I can change those out. If I want it to be black, if I want it to be blue, purple, whatever, just add some other curtains. I'm probably not gonna do that because that took a lot of work. I gotta go up there and nah, I'm not gonna do that. So um, yeah, this is my desk, you guys, where everything goes down. I have a iMac, of course. And I have this little storage thing now that I got from Marshalls and it just kind of housed all of my camera equipment, which I like that so that I can see it and be able to grab some stuff. I have like business stuff, filing cabinet, printer over there. These chairs, the fuzzy one and the clear one I got from TJ Maxx. And I also, I got this from at home. It's like a little, I don't know, whatever, a little bookshelf, but it's, very nice and different i just spray painted it gold and i just put my makeup on it and a few little other things to be in the background of my videos but that was pretty easy to put together honestly and then i have two windows i have this the paris vogue photo that i think i got from like tj maxx or marshall's or something like that and then this is my filming equipment if you want to see like a filming equipment video let me know below if you're getting into youtube and just kind of want to see what i use and all that good stuff then i could definitely film that for you 
And then this is a closet that I have in here. And you, I got my mannequin heads. I got some hair. Oh, girl, I don't know what I got out here. Let me see. Um, the hot mess, just a lot of mess. A little hair stuff. Anything I need, I have it up in here, basically. <laughs> so let's let's go. Let's leave the room. Here is the view from if you walk up the steps and turn to your left. So this is my laundry room. I just have this hanging here to dry. It's dry now though, but this is the laundry room. No, nothing too fancy. Nothing fancy at all, actually. I was just telling my mom I want another wash and dryer though, because this one is like old. So one day at a time honey one day at a time okay so you can also see my bedroom and if you walk in this is kind of what you see my bed is from z gallery and my end tables are from amazon the lamps are from home goods and of course that's just a victoria's secret bag this bench is from tj maxx and i made this little plant thingy this is basically a mason jar painted gold and i just added some fake flowers to it so that's pretty much what that is and i also just like keep some knickknacks on my um thingy this is just some candy this is just some candy and this is actually a um, iPhone 10 charger you know you can charge it by putting your phone there and this is just a coaster from one of my friends weddings and I keep my water there because I'd be thirsty and then I got that painting from Burlington of the horse and I also got this painting here um, from TJ Maxx I shop at TJ Maxx a lot okay they have what I need and that little this little abstract thingy here is from Burlington as well so and that's just a Alexa oh don't worry I did not want her to hear me hmm. I don't know that okay, shit. um all right so this is my closet my closet did not come like this me I put this together this is actually a like organizer closet organizer from ikea it was about 200 dollars. you custom make it you can put um wherever you want the drawers if you want the drawers here if you want the pants to hang over there like you could or if you don't want that like you can customize everything on their site and this is kind of how it looks i'm sorry i'm getting excited to show you guys because i haven't shown you guys and i did this all by myself because I am, first of all, I'm a handy person. So if you're not a handy person, then definitely don't try this at home. But um, I also added this mirror is from Ikea as well. And those little boxes are from Ikea, I think as well. So if you guys wanna really see a closet tour and me to kind of go into detail about different things, let me know. And this is just a swimsuit um, this is actually like a little organizer for your door, but I add all my swimsuits here. I feel like this is just perfect. I want to see them. I want to know so that I can grab and go to the beach or whatever. Okay, and if you um, are on the bed, you kind of see my jewelry organizer, which is there. And I keep that door open with my shoes <laughs> right there. I literally keep the door open. And if you guys are wondering what that is, that's just like a waterproof you know phone thingy and then i have my tv here i was actually watching amy <laughs> so random but I was, I was watching her and also i have a bluetooth i did get this mounted the correct way as you can see okay so now it's time for the bathroom and i just have well this is an overview of the bathroom so right here is just a toilet <laughs> that's all okay nothing too exciting in there guys and then I have my vanity area well that's what they call it so it has two lights I could have got a double sink but I voted not to because I wanted to put my um, hamper under there in a trash can this is my sink and I just have my products that I'm gonna review next just on the counter just kind of remind me 
to do it. This is the Eco um, Cannabis Sativa Oil line, and they have a gel. So their complete line is right here. I'm gonna do a review. It's coming, it's coming. That's my it's coming dance. So then I have this little shelf where I house all of the little stuff I use on a day-to-day -day basis. And then I have the shower. I always have my towel right here. Um, but this is my shower. Got some hair, but I just washed my hair. My hair is deep conditioner, so I just washed my hair. So I don't even. And I got this new shower head, which I'm obsessed with. So it comes out really nice. Like, let me show you. So pleasant to even listen to. I also have a filter on it, so the water that's coming out is pure and chlorine free. And I just have, um, these are like my favorite products. And well, these are just the products that I use for my wash day. And all of that is like stuff that I use for my face. And I have a speaker up here because I listen to music every time I get in the shower. And I have an African sponge here, which is what I use to shower with. And I just have a magic cloth to wipe my makeup. So that's all. And you guys know, shower mirror is a must for us curly girls who need to see ourselves or whatever. So um, that is pretty much the entire house, guys. That was the last single thing. And I hope you guys really liked it. Like I said, if you want to see something in depth, more in depth and you um, want to... You want me to break something down in a particular room just let me know but i hope you guys like this video if you did give it a thumbs up and i'll see you guys in my next video bye